Welcome back to AS Plus. For over 50 years, Body Glove has grown alongside surfing to become one of the most recognizable action sports brands out on the market. Body Glove has something for everyone on your holiday shopping list, so we made the short trip to Redondo Beach to take a closer look at this family-owned business. Body Glove International was founded by twin brothers Bob and Bill Maestrel. Although having passed on several years ago, Bill is always on the mind of brother Bob. My twin brother was born on July the 30th, 1928, and I was born on July the 31st, 1928. He was my older brother. We were raised by our mother. Our, our father was uh, murdered when we were four years old. So we moved to California, and she raised seven kids by herself. After forming roots in Redondo Beach, California, Bob and Bill set out to build a business around their love of the ocean, explains Body Glove's VP of Marketing, Scott Daly. Body Glove found its home here in 1953. Bob and Bill Maestro established a business at Dive and Surf with a gentleman by the name of Bev Morgan. When we got out of the Army, I didn't like this guy named Bev Morgan because he had used my surfboard without my permission. He married my brother's fiance while he was in Korea, so I thought two of us could go down there and beat him up. That's the way we took care of bullies in school. Next thing I know, Bill went down and saw him, and we're in business together. Shortly after Bob and Bill went into business at their surf shop, Dive and Surf, they started to develop what would become the wetsuit. Even today, there's some debate whether Bob and Bill were the first to make the wetsuit. I think where Bob and Bill and, and Bev are right is that they had the first commercially viable product that was for sale in surf shops and dive stores. I got almost proof that we were first, but I'm not going to argue about it with anybody. Not long after 1953, Bob and Bill Maestro, along with partner Bev Morgan, would start to grow the dive and surf brand into what it would become. My twin brother and I were sitting around with Duke Boyd, and Duke Boyd helped start Lightning Bolt and OP, and Bill and him were talking one night, and then Duke says, what makes your suit so much better than anybody else's? And Bill said, that's like a glove. And Duke said, well, let's call it body glove. Former pro surfer and current employee Greg Browning has had a long history with the company. It's a family-owned business. The same people that were here when I was 12 are still here when I'm 37. Today, Greg is the director of Body Glove Entertainment. You know, this year we signed Jamie O'Brien, one of the greatest free surfers to ever be. We also have Alex Gray, who's had one of the best years ever. Shane Magnuson, free surf wonder. They're great guys, not just the best riders, they're the best personalities out there. As Body Glove has grown through the years, it has stayed close to its core values and remained a family-owned business. We had a lot of offers over the years to sell the company, and we just thought, well, you know, my brother and I never went to work. We always went to play. We had so damn much fun, it was unbelievable. Bob and Bill were pioneers of the ocean, and their whole goal objective was to make sure that they were on the beach longer, they were in the water longer, and that they were comfortable. And that was the fundamental goal objective of why they created this company. It's been a great time. Uh, I think our, our parents would be very proud of us. If you want to skip the malls this year, you can shop at bodyglove.com.